Hello. Hi, Buddha. My name is DJ. Uh, How can I help you? I'm a, a member of the Saints. Yeah. I believe that you now have ownership of the mana. Congratulations. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. I was wondering if we could chat, potentially, about something you may not be aware of in this sale. Uh, I am aware of everything in this sale, sir. You're aware Contracts of a... are way more powerful oh. than words. Are you aware of a court injunction that he wasn't allowed to sell this place? Uh, I didn't see it anywhere in the contract, sir. I don't personally give a fuck about this place, to be honest with you. Um, well, that's the thing. Is it, it, was it in the contract or was it not in the contract? Are you guys just saying these things or is there a contract? No, it's, on, it's on the docket. We had a court, impending court case on this place, which had a injunction. It's on the docket? To you stop gotta... the sale. You had a, yeah, but how are you going to stop the sale? You have no contract of anything. Because the court case was, uh, the crux of the court case was the ownership of the manor. Yeah, but he is the, the sole owner. He had the contract. You know what I mean? Uh, like I said, I, 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 I don't care if you have this place. Uh, but listen, listen, I listen. Just, uh, yeah. I, I don't intend to keep the place. It's just, uh, you know. Uh, if the Saints want it back, they uh, you know they better get ready to uh, campaign and get into the political game like they never have before and make sure I win uh, the next election. Sounds funny you should say that, Mr. Buddha. Why? Are you inside the manor? I mean, maybe this should be said in person between just me and you. Or me and whoever you're in the manor with. Yeah, I'm out back. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Playing a dangerous game here, Harry. You have a gun? Yeah, always. I have to use Crowd forming outside. Hello, Mr. Buddha. How's it going, my so, man? How you doing? You turn this fucking stupid radio off. Um. It's funny you should mention that because uh, you're probably aware that we was approached by a different person for the same thing. Uh, I think I the timing of that is, is very interesting. Uh, why did Benji okay. approach you? So basically what happened is um, we was told that Billy and Benji had signed a contract for this place. Um, and that Benji was going to be the owner. This is before we had any idea that you was going to be buying the place or anything. Um, and then Benji approached uh, one of our higher ups, or our underboss, um, about you know, a freeway deal, which involved uh, right. voting for somebody. Um, Benji did not outright say who, um, but after seeing um, you know a certain expungement being spoken about on Twitter. And other talkings, we kind of, you know, figured out who it was. Who is it? We believe it to be Nick Simone. His That's one of his, one of his, uh, one of his puppets. So probably, wait, he's getting expunged himself? Uh, he was trotting out about getting an expungement. Okay, interesting. Um, now, listen. All right, I don't know what rank you are on the Saints or who... Uh, I'm the highest rank awake right now. The highest rank awake. All right, you tell your boss yeah, yeah, yeah. or your people... I am more than willing to give you guys back this house for free. Don't care about the money I spent to even purchase this place. But I need the votes, and I need to, the, I need to guarantee that I win the next election. You get this house for free if I win the next election. You lose this house forever if I lose. Okay. When's the next election? Do you know? Like when it's uh, like due? Not it's, it's soon, it's right? Up it's like in the, the next air. month or so? I have okay, no okay, idea. Okay. If it never happens, then we can talk about a purchase price for you guys to reacquire the house. But uh, for now, I'll hold on to it for a couple of weeks. You guys can even operate out of this shithole still. I don't give a fuck. And then uh, if the second term were to happen, I, I, I don't know. It uh, might not happen. I have no fucking idea. Uh, we go from there. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Like I said, from our standpoint, we kind of accepted this was pretty much gone. We was only going the court route to, you know, uh, see if we could get it back. Um, but yeah, I uh, Well, tell I your people you that's my offer. Speak. Yeah, and uh, I appreciate I'm telling that. you right now, nobody else will give you that offer ever. I know, and, and I appreciate that. So thank you very much, Mr. Buddha. No problem. Appreciate you.
Have a wonderful day. You too. This was a 19, this was a $20 million investment, by the way. Well, I think it's, you know, I have a really good idea or a really bad idea. What? Well, what are you doing? I think it's a good idea. I mean, no one's going to ever give them th that offer. You know what I mean? Yeah. All they have to do is yeah. make sure I win the election. Now it's on them. If they want that house that bad, it's on them. You know what I mean? So, and those, listen, people, I, I can't believe I'm about to compliment the Saints. They've stuck around. They've been, uh, what's the word? Stubborn. And I, out of all the L's th this group has taken, they, they've went through them and stayed together and keep building. And there's a lot of them. Yeah. So, you know, that commitment, uh, they apply that to a campaign, uh, you know, that I win. I, I have no, I'm not even lying. I'll give them this house back for free. I have no problem. 